local mother is speaking out about questionable autopsy findings at the Marion County Coroner's Office. She believes a possible suspect in her daughter's death has gone free for more than two years because of a ruling. Now at the center of this case is a pathologist now under scrutiny in Chicago and here in Indianapolis. 13 Investigates reporter Sandra Chapman first told us about the investigations and Sandra's back tonight with the growing calls for a case review. Sandra? Scott, these cases all have one thing in common. That's Dr. John Cavanaugh, a contractor with the Marion County Coroner's Office. He was fired from the Cook County Medical Examiner's Office in Chicago last November after officials there say he missed a murder. So far, eight of 23 cases reviewed in Chicago have resulted in a change of the cause or manner of death. Now a local mother believes the same thing should happen in her daughter's case here. 37-year-old Jessica Elliott died in 2015 after a fight with her boyfriend. Jessica's autopsy was performed by Dr. Cavanaugh. He confirmed head trauma but ruled the manner of death undetermined. Both the family and police say evidence that could have helped Jessica's case was ignored. She got nothing. Uh, to me, it was like everybody let her down. Dr. Cavanaugh has worked with the Marion County Coroner's Office for seven years. Chief Deputy Coroner Alfie Ballou previously said the office had not had any problems with Dr. Cavanaugh, but we now know the case of Jessica Elliott has been called into question, not just by this family, but by investigators. Coming up in just an hour, we'll show you why this case is not going away.